what is a composite? It's a new material. Well, I like to tell people that it's not a new material. Uh, a composite material is basically combining two materials. Uh, composites exist uh, naturally. Uh, wood is a natural composite. Uh, your bone is a natural composite. Um, and, and composites were used all the way back to the, to the days of ancient Egyptians when they built pyramids. We're using straw and, uh, uh, to make, uh, with mud to make bricks. So, so composites have been around for a long time. We're just using a different fiber and a different resin. So uh, being that a bone is a natural composite, what better to replace uh, a piece of bone than another composite instead of a hard piece of metal like a, a steel or titanium. Here are a number of medical devices and some composite products. This talks to the flexibility that can be achieved with composites. And remember, composites are two things. There is a strengthening agent and there's a bonding agent. But you can do things with composites that you simply can't do with metal, you can't do with titanium, you can't do with ceramics, and one of which is the flexibility. This is a section of a wing and you can design a composite to achieve the flexibility or the strength and then to deal with the climatic circumstances of an airplane and just consider the difference between flying at 36,000 feet or trying to take off from Phoenix uh, in the middle of August. And an airplane uh, has to be able to deal with that variety and depending upon the strength of the flexibility that you need in the particular part of the airplane, you design the composite to accomplish that and, and all of that varies. Uh, and that, again, is part of the magic.